James Melendez, James the Wine Guy, stay tuned for your review of this beautiful Lodi Old Vine Zinfandel. Very excited about this wine, and actually I did a review of the 2010 vintage. I'll post that video right here. Uh, but for me, I think Old Vine Zinfandel is just such a beautiful expression and something that is uh, almost uh, definable and yet not definable at the same time. So here we go, the proper introduction of this wine. This is Fields Family. It's from the Sherman Family Vineyard Lodi, Old Vine Zinfandel 2011 vintage, 14.8% ABV, back panel for inspection here. Only 200 cases produced. Um, this is a handsome, gorgeous wine, and something I think is that uh, prototypical Zinfandel that uh, I often hope for but don't always get. And what I mean by that is um, I think Zinfandel has this unique characteristic of being this uh, beautiful wine where uh, it gets a sense of age but also a sense of freshness. And uh, what I would call a trill, it goes between the experiences of uh, delicateness and definitiveness, and, and I think that's a beauty. And so, really, only the best way to describe that is through the musical term of a trill. Uh, but for me, this is a beautiful wine, something that is really expressive, complex, and uh, outstanding notes here. So, what I would recommend for this wine is to take this and pour in a Bordeaux glass. I think it's a fantastic way, and in fact, I'll put more in my glass right now. It needs to have a little bit more. Uh, I think to express itself in terms of the scent and flavor characteristic. So uh, really a gorgeous wine here, a beautiful mouthfeel. But before I do that, I want to describe this wine. So here we go for scent characteristics, flavor profile, and then the point score. So here we go first with the scent characteristics. Mm, gorgeous notes on this include blackberry, cherry, strawberry, forest floor, pine cone, suede, lavender, and eucalyptus. So here we go next with the flavor characteristics. Mm. Gorgeous notes on this wine include black cherry, strawberry. I love those two notes together because they don't seem to be possible, but it is. Crushed red candy, violets, cardamom, sage, and black tea. Now, this wine is a 9.4 out of my 10.0 scale. Now, uh, for me, I think this is an amazing year. I, I'm just so excited about 2014 because not that the other years uh, prior to this uh, tasting year of 2014 have been uh, less exciting, but I think when I look at uh, in terms of diversity and tasting wines from all around the world and uh, tasting a lot more wines from Lodi, uh, I have actually been for the past two years, but to really focus in on this area that's worked extremely hard to uh, you know bring their, their wines to the marketplace and uh, really a lot of old families that have been producing a multi-generation family is the best way of saying that, uh, producing uh, wine grapes for a long time, producing wines from the grapes that they grow. And I think it's a really wonderful thing. So stay with me on this great journey of wine. More to come. And if you like this video review, please give a like right here. Share this video. And uh, please, uh, you know, give some comments and uh, questions down below for, you know, your old wine Zinfandels or Zinfandels or wines from Lodi, whatever you want to talk about. And uh, please subscribe to my video channel right here on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching. More to come. I'm on most social medias, Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google+, and Pinterest. Salut.